Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Super Castlevania 4. Do I sound different? Well, if I do, it's because I got a new headset today. I was going to record this video last night, but pff, right before I decided to, my old headset just completely died on me, so I was out of luck there, and what the heck? Got red guys coming out of the wall. Might have to go up here if I want to make any progress. So what should you should do... Oh, I see you hiding behind there. Uh, hopefully these green things don't fall. It looks like the ones over there didn't. It's kind of weird how they're different from the rest of the floor, though. Ah, how am I going to tell those things coming out of the wall? I wasn't paying attention to the wall, so I didn't know if there was an indicator or not. Maybe they have the hands like they do up there. I'm getting jumped on by skeletons. I guess he's not going to come out. Alright, we got some platforming to do. Floating platforms away. There we go. Shh, easy as pie. Bring on the challenge. Oh, we're not done with the first section yet. I don't want to jinx myself. I say that all the time, but I really don't. See, it looks like they just come out of nowhere. These skulls watch my every move. Doesn't make things any better. Oh, I might, might as well get that. Oh! Oh, so that's what they do. Why didn't the other ones do that? I may, I guess if it's just like hanging by itself, that's when it's going to turn on you. Dang, so I'm going to have to be quick with those jumps. I got teased too with the freaking uh, knife that was on there. Those don't turn on the side, do they? I'm just going to say screw it and go... What? Huh? I can't be on there? But I have to get, jump on it in order to get across. But it looked like it flipped immediately. Do I have to land in the middle of it? Is that what's is that what's going on? And my weight was too far off to the right, and that's why. Well, I'm gonna try it again. This time, try to land in the center. Whoa! Okay, I had to be really quick that time. I still don't know if it just flips automatically or if you have to shift your weight or what. Hopefully, there aren't too many of those in here, but you know there will be. It's kind of like the theme of the let. Oh! Ugh. I hate those things already, man. I really do. Uh, it's a good thing it starts me at this part and not the very beginning, even though this is still block 4-1. And this is my last life, my gosh. It's not like I got that far anyway. And hopefully I have unlimited continues here. I think I do, if it's like the first Castlevania game. Quickly get across- No! Ah, if you stall for like a millisecond, you're not going anywhere. Oh, that's gonna be a real pain getting across those. But we gotta do it. Alright, we're back to these evil things. I already lost a life in the last section experimenting with these. It seems like when you walk across them, they won't flip, but when you're jumping on them, that's when they're going to start flipping on you. But the thing is, you're going to have to jump if you want to get across, at least I'm pretty certain. So really, my best bet is just go as quickly as I can. Oh my gosh. You really have to jump right when you land in order to get past that, because if you waste any amount of time, you're just going to go down, down the hill. Uh, so what I'm gonna what I thought if you walked across them they don't flip uh, This game's playing with my mind man It looked like I didn't even walk onto it and it started flipping on me. That was crazy I don't know. I'm gonna have trouble here. I can just taste it This one I can I can do okay on as long as I Jump really quickly, so let's try it oh, no. Freaks me out every time Okay, now I gotta prepare how to deal with the next ones. Maybe I should take that top route. Might be a little bit safer, but even that flipped me. Ugh, I gotta get my jumps right. I'm just gonna try to jump over them this time. Alright, that seemed to work out. Screw all those candles in the bottom. Screw that pla- Oh, I have to go that way. I'm blocked off. Great, so- Ugh, okay. You have to do some really quick jumps, man. They really test that skill here. And here's another. You can jump over these, though. Oh, bats again. As if this wasn't annoying enough. Alright, I think we're doing okay now. Seems like we're getting out of that area with all the green things. Do you already have a boss? My gosh. Alright. Oh, it did take me a while to get here. Oh my gosh, that thing. It's freaky. It's got a long tongue and everything, and I'm just having rocks falling down on me. Just had my famous strategy of swing wildly and hope for the best. Well, it worked that time. Do we get a refill? Whoa, Simon's moving on his own here. Well, might as well. Oh gosh, spikes. That's never good. 
Never good at all. I want some chicken. Let's find a KFC somewhere around here. Right, we're swinging, huh? That's the point. Whoa! Whoa! Holy crap! I've actually seen this before in videos, but I have no idea how to do it, so I'm just gonna wait for that little platform there to get to the bottom. I guess we can probably jump on it now. Can we get through? I guess we're gonna fall through. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> now we got Medusa's head! Medusa heads! Oh gosh, I didn't jump far enough. I don't know if that's what I was supposed to do or not. Let's try it again, I guess. Could it? Whoa, okay, it's gonna start rotating without it. Got such a short rip, whip right now. And there's no way I can swing all the way across, so... I have an idea, actually, if I can have those Medusa heads coming. Will it keep turning if I stay on? Nope. So I'm gonna... Whoa! That was my plan, but... Ugh, I wanted to be on the platform first. What the heck? How am I gonna get across here? Ugh. Maybe I have to stay in the middle until all the Medusa heads get by? I don't know, man. I really don't. Maybe it's kind of a survival game. You have to wait until it starts rotating again. Might as well try that. I have the short whip, though. That's gonna make it worse. And this is my last life. If I get hit once, you're into the spikes. So there's no fooling around here. As long as I can get them when they're coming down, it should be okay. Let's hope there's not just an infinite stream of them. Come on. Don't have all day. Something tells me I have to move on. Oh, okay. Yeah. Just, oh, I better get hanging on again. I don't know if I have to fall down in that pit or not. Well, it looks like the rest is just spikes, but that took me down to a pit. So that was not what I had to do. I'll see you guys back there. Oh, this is bad, guys. Look how many lives I've lost already. One of them is to this freaking boss right here. Because I was down a little bit of life last time, so that might have been why. And uh, Don't do that. Oh, come on, hit him. Please do not. <gasps> come on. I gotta get the last hit. Oh, I did not want to die again to that guy. Too bad he doesn't give you a life refill, though. I could really use that. So I'm gonna go try to attack all these Medusa heads with one hit left. Oh well, we gotta try. Can't complain. We're getting to the big boy game now. Oh my gosh. At least we'll have one more life in here. So I can try to get a little bit farther in this rotating room. If, I, if I'm not supposed to go over there into that pit, why even have a pit there? Just have more spikes or something. Those are still one hit kills, aren't they? Whoa, okay, I guess I could dodge the heads too. Never really thought about that. Yeah, it's easy enough to just kill him, get him out of the way. As long as you stay off to the opposite side, you should be pretty safe. You now we gotta grab on. So what I'm gonna do here, just wait, just kind of chill in the air for a little bit. They better not have things flying at me when I'm hanging. You know they're going to. You just know they're going to. What am I doing, man? Could I have got down to that bottom right area there? Really, whoa, okay, we got blocks coming now. Let's get on. Alright, right. I think I can walk in this area. Yep, I can. Okay, oh, now we're at 4 3. Oh man. Oh, we're spinning. Whoa, oh, we got the floor falling behind us. We're gonna have to move along here. Oh my gosh, this room is so laggy. Oh, that's what I get for emulating this game, though. Maybe I did this on the actual Super Nintendo! <laughs> oh well, we have another life. Move, Simon, move! Got some, like, secret agent music going on. Oh my gosh, I can't handle that lag there, man. Alright. There's no way my GPU's worse than a freaking Super Nintendo. Better not be. Alright. Ooh. Gotta upgrade the whip. So far, this isn't that bad. You just gotta move quick. Move quick and swing your whip. No, uh, no. I said move quick. It seemed like they stopped falling there for a second. I haven't seen one fall in a long time. Alright. Moving along here. Oh, now it's gonna start spinning the other way. Okay, that wasn't that bad. Where are we going now? Ooh. This kinda reminds me of Super Mario World. Don't know why. You always have those blocks that go up and down. 
Okay, I guess I can get through now once this is up. There we go. Can I fall down here? It kind of looks like maybe, but nope. Oh, purple spikes. Are they like poison tipped? I'm trying to get up here, but... Oh, there we go. Thought I could do it. Oh, boy. I'm gonna try and get crushed here. Alright, as long as we keep moving along, should be good. Alright. So what's so special about this upper level, huh? Huh? Guess we'll find out. I guess this is the way I had to go. I don't know, maybe there's a bunch of ways you can go here. I should have probably went up to the right there. But oh well. We'll just wait. This is making me nervous. I don't want to get crushed. Looks like we got a block up here that'll help us though. Do, 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 do. Such frantic music too. Uh-huh. Oh, too bad I don't can't get that cross over there. Oh well. Alright, so that's not that bad. It's way easier than the past. Oh wait, this is 4-4. Four, four. This actually has three four sections in this level, huh? I guess they all don't have just three. Oh, I'll get over there. Okay. Where are we going? Huh? Is this a dead end? I guess so. A little bit of a rest area. I'm not even going to try to go out there yet. I'll just wait. I'll be patient. It's my last life, after all. Um, so we're actually going up to the left here? I don't know. Ugh. I don't know, man. I want to keep climbing. Hopefully this isn't a dead end. Just a small opening here. Am I, like, looping? I don't think so. But it sure is a long way up, isn't it? Now we wait some more. Ding, 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 ding. Dance, Simon, dance. Okay, that looks like an opening here. Let's rush to it. Alright, this one's not a dead end, hopefully. I'm gonna try to be hit by these, because you never know if they're one-hit kills or not. There's similar things in Castlevania 1 that were one-hit kills, and they were very annoying, and oh my gosh, it's going so fast! I'm gonna have to go immediately. Oh no! Run! 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 Oh, I got past it. Phew. I need an item. I need an item. Just to keep me safe. Hope there isn't another boss here. There wasn't another boss in the last level, but you never know. They might pull it out. Okay, I'll take care of this guy. Uh, I might have been able to just use axes on him, but can't quite reach, so I'll just be patient. As long as I duck, I should be safe. There we go. Pretty big winding staircase here. This is almost the last level worthy. No, we're not even close. That scares me dearly. It's just those green things that really took a toll on me, and, well, it looks like there is another boss here. We're at full life, so bring it on. It's getting dark. Oh my gosh. Oh, what? <gasps> Scary. Throw axes at it. Make it die. Okay, enough of that. We need the whip. We need the real gun. Oh my gosh! Oh, you... I can't predict where the things are going to fall, and it takes so long to move that I can't dodge them. Oh, dang. Alright, let's try it again. Oh, all the way at back at the beginning. Why? I'll see you guys there. Oh, you asshole. Buh. No! Stop getting hit by that freaking skeleton. You are never getting hit by him before. <sighs> I hate this level. Oh, that was just dumb. And I got a game over trying to get back to where I was. Level 4, man. There's 11 levels in this game. Can you believe it? Ah, uh, but we gotta persevere. We can't give up yet. I'll never give up. Never! Alright guys, here I am back in the area before the boss, and I have all my lives intact. I, I almost want to scrap all the footage I've recorded before, and just include that last run and just post commentate over that, but what's the fun in showing a good run, right? Alright, so we gotta get past this room here. Get to the golem boss, or the mummy boss, or whatever it is. To me it looked like a golem, but I guess a mummy is also plausible in this kind of game. 
grab the useless axes. I think it's because I used the axes the first time that I would I probably would have had a better chance if I didn't use the axes is what I'm trying to say. Okay. Patient. Eh, I might as well just skip over that thing. It's not like you have to kill every enemy. Uh, whoa. I'm just gonna hit by that fireball. You want to save as much damage as you can. I would really like to go back to this boss with full health again. It's probably my best chance to doing them this time. I forget where he comes down. I think it's over here on the right. So let's just keep swinging wildly. We got our expert strategy and ah, uh, yeah, that's uh, definitely a goal. And he's throwing rocks at you and everything. Uh, dodge the one that fell down. I'm not doing much damage at all. Come on, I gotta get the wild swings in. Maybe anyway, I should stay over here on the right. Come on, stop jumping in the air. I need to hit you. Oh no, I'm taking way more damage than he is. That's a thing. He is a golem, I guess. But come on, come on. No! Ugh. Damn you! And I have to start all the way at the beginning of this section again. Phew. We'll get him next time. All right. I I actually thought of something while I was coming back up here that might work. He drops down those two platforms that are on the left and right side, and there's things falling down from the ceiling. I wasn't noting, noticing if those blocks falling from the ceiling would crack once they hit those platforms, but I might be able to use those as a shield. It's just a hunch, though, so you never know. Let's get up to this guy. I'm gonna... I, I think I have the right whip, so I'm just gonna skip all these and head straight up there. Oh yeah, we got these statues to deal with. Uh, I probably should wait until I deal with these guys until I explain my strategy. Uh, I was so close that last time. It was ridiculous. Should have been done with this. Because he kept jumping him in the air and I didn't get a good shot on him then. Alright, so let's see if we can use these platforms. Uh, looks like... Ah, uh, you can't even duck under him, really. Uh, that's kind of useless. Back to strategy of swinging wildly! He does this weird size change whenever you hit him, too. It's really weird. I don't know if it's supposed to do that or what. Ah, oh, we're so neck and neck. Come on. Take damage. It's not fair, man. No! Gosh! <sighs> what am I doing wrong? I'm not dodging the things that are falling from the ceiling, but it's not like I have a chance once I see them, because once you see them, you have a millisecond to move away. Oh, why was I ducking? Why was I ducking? I did not mean to duck and get crushed like that. By the way, I have a slightly altered strategy to just swing your whip wildly. Whenever he does that jump in the air, I think what I'm going to do is just swing some axes up, and those should be able to reach him, and I might be able to get that extra damage in that I need. Ah, but I gotta get there again. Jeez, I wasted a life I should not have wasted there. I need all the lives I can get. Alright, let's see if my plan can come to fruition. Come on. Get out here. Oh! Ah, I could have dodged that if I moved just a tiny bit more to the left. And where's the axes? I said I was going to throw some axes. They aren't doing anything. Oh, God. Ah, let's ride this platform. Why not? Well, I'm actually getting some damage in. I'm a tiny bit ahead. This is my best chance. Come on. Don't fail it, Simon. Don't throw it away. Don't throw it away. Ah, oh, it's because he was dancing all over me. He wouldn't get the hell off me. Oh, my God. Last life. Alright, here we go, boys and girls. Wish me luck. Uh, I gotta dodge the first wave that comes down. Okay, it's actually not that bad. Maybe if I keep watching the top, I can dodge this a little bit easier. Okay, there's the second wave. Oh, the ones he throws are a little bit harder, though, because he throws them right in front of him. Oh, he better not come up right on me. Okay, he turns around. Good. I'm dodging more of them. That's good. Okay, so that's... Whoop, whoop. Don't, don't get cocky now. You're not done yet. But you are missing a lot. Or getting dodging a lot. Okay, this should be it. I, I have... <sighs> if I just took my time and watched the blocks fall down and not, you know, stick to my plan of swing wildly and ignore everything going around, that's not that bad of a fight. Well, lesson learned. You actually have to use strategy in this game. Okay, we're going to take that with us into the next levels. Where are we going now? How much distance did we find there? Well, we're getting 
That looks like the last tower, doesn't it? Almost. I don't know where the heck we are as far as close to Dracula goes. And it looks like we're outside again with some weird grass, like a blue road. I don't know. We'll check it out next time, though. I'll see you guys then. Thanks for watching this catastrophe.